Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Simply Destiny. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. Today I am doing a very exciting video because all of my videos have been nursing related lately. So today is a little fun video about my beautiful, beautiful Telfar Black Mini. So I just wanna point out something. I did just get braces, so please, please don't judge me. If it looks weird when I talk, I'm I'm trying to readjust. So yes, without further ado, let's jump right into this video. I have decided to do a video, not only just showing you guys my Telfar Mini, but also giving you guys some tips and tricks on how you guys can secure your bag because these bags run out like, like that, like in seconds. Literally they drop and in two seconds, they're gone. So. I thought it'd be helpful to give you guys some tips and tricks that really helped me secure my bag. And I'm gonna show you guys some things that you can fit in the mini because it is a little tiny bag and I know you guys are like, what the hell can you fit in that bag? So I got y'all, I'm gonna show y'all what I can fit in my bag. And I'm just gonna show you guys the different styles that you can wear the bag in. So yes, let's go. So here is my mini. She's so beautiful, isn't she? Like. It's the black owned designer for me, really. Like, I'm so excited to finally own one of these bags. I really just feel like, like that B-A-C-C-H, you know, when I have this bag, I really feel like that girl with this bag. So here's the bag and it has two um, handles here. You can carry it like that or you can do the crossbody, which is very popular. That's how I wear my bag. It's just easier for me to just throw it over myself. And then it also has a second strap. So two straps. I don't usually wear two. I don't usually have both of them out. So I just fold it up and stick it in my bag. So then it's just like this. And you can just put it over you like that and you know wear it over you wear it cross body cute cross body so let's go on to showing you what can fit in this mini so when you wear a mini bag honestly you just have to wear you just have to bring along the essentials don't try to stuff everything that you can fit in a medium-sized tote bag in your mini bag just don't do that because they're small so you know just the essentials so first i have some hand lotion okay this is a 2.7 fluid ounce lotion so i'm gonna stick that in my bag because you know you can't have ashy hands some blistex is winter time my lips be burning so my blistex i gotta keep it on me you know little perfume this is just like the roll-on perfume you do that or if you have oils like the little bottle of oils you can you can carry a couple of those with you make sure that the top is on tight though you don't want to spill it in your bag some hand sanitizer because covid you know gotta gotta stay sanitized and usually i'll have my cards in my phone case because I don't know, I don't I don't like to carry a wallet, honestly. So I'll just put my cards in the back in my phone case, the back of my phone case. But since I'm recording on my phone, I cannot show you guys my, putting my phone in. But I do have the iPhone XR or whatever the 10 for reference. So here is my case. So my phone is this big. So just imagine my phone in this case. And then I'll just put my cards like that. And then my phone on top of them. So then I'll stick that in my bag. And it's really cool because your phone doesn't have to stick out like that. Unless you unless you stuff your bag with other things, you don't have to have your phone like that. It can fit perfectly fine like that. So you don't have to have it poking up poking you know out of your bag and that's why I also don't encourage you to bring like a big wallet because then you're gonna have to have it poking out like that and I don't know 
you don't want that. So if you have like a little miniature wallet for your, just for your cards, you can you can put that in there. But remember, this is a mini, so you know you have to only put a little bit of stuff and stuff that's pretty small. So there's that lip gloss. You got to keep lip gloss on you, or at least I do. So I'm a lip gloss. Oh, and my keys. So my keys are so extra, but my keys. Let's try to put that in here. That is perfect. So I can't um, button it because it does have a button. I cannot button it because it's pretty stuffed to the top. But you see, it fits perfectly fine. All of your essentials can fit in this mini bag. All of your essentials. Um, so another thing that I really want to point out is this is a vegan leather bag. So not only is it black owned, it's vegan leather. So I just feel good about this purchase because again, it's black owned. And then on top of that, it's vegan leather. So no animals were, you know, hurt in the making of these bags. And I love that. So it's guilt-free shopping for me. So that's, a, that is, those are two main reasons why I love this brand so, so much. And I feel like that's also two of the main reasons why, two of the main reasons why everybody else loves these bags also. So, and this is that. So now let's go into the tips and tricks to securing your bag. So one, I would encourage you guys to sign up for the mailing list. So I know he, um, the owner, he had a bag security program. I missed out on the bag security program. Um, and that was a couple of months ago. So that program is no longer a thing. So what you will need to do is go on the website, sign up for the mailing list for all of the color bags that you want, every bag that you want, go through the website, every item, every bag that you want, whatever, make sure you sign up for the notifications for when they come in stock. So I did that. But I did not put my notifications to my phone. So I was receiving the emails. I just didn't get the emails because I don't check my email that often. So by the time I checked my email, the bag was already released and already sold out. So you wanna make sure that not only do you sign up for the mailing list for each bag or each other item that he offers that you are interested in getting if it's sold out on the site, you want to make sure that not only are you signing up to be notified when they come in, but also that your notifications come directly to your phone. And if you have several email accounts, which I do, make sure you sign up. If, if you don't mind, use the email that has the le like the least amount of activity. So that way you're not getting several notifications throughout the day, you know, so it's easier to sort through. Um, also, once you do that, make sure that you have Apple Pay or I believe PayPal as well. I use Apple Pay though. So make sure that you have Apple Pay and or PayPal already connected to your phone. That way your checkout time is like cut in half. Like honestly, it was like that. It, it literally went so quick. Um, you wanna make sure that you have that on file, your card information, your address and stuff like that on file so it can you can just breeze through the checkout. You don't want to spend time like typing all the information you want to get in and get out okay like honestly just so that way you can secure your bag another thing i wanted to mention um aside from making sure that you have the notifications and that you have paypal or apple pay associated with your phone already um you want to make sure that you wake up about at, at about 8 30 or 8 45 something like that so that way you can just stay on the site and you can just keep reloading keep refreshing that's what i did it released at 9 a.m and so i set an alarm i set two alarms i set one for like 8 20 and then again for 8 30 or 8 45 something like that so that way i could give myself some time to actually get up and so I did that and I was on the site and I was constantly refreshing, refreshing, and then nine o'clock came. I refreshed again and I already had my screen on the actual item that I wanted anyways. So, you know, it was it was as soon as I refreshed it at 9 a.m., it was refreshed and I was able to go ahead and put it in my cart and then checked out using Apple Pay. It took me every bit of three to four minutes. It was so, so quick. And then on top of the fact that it was so quick to purchase, 
the shipping was super quick i was actually really shocked i ordered my bag one morning literally i received it maybe three to four days later i'm not lying to you guys he's very efficient the owner of this brand is very 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 efficient so i really like that as well and i have an app called shop i believe that's the app name if it's not i will definitely just go ahead and leave it in the description box so that way you guys can go and check it out and so i was able to just track my item through that app i believe that's all i really have to say it's a very short sweet simple video i just wanted to share with you guys some tips and tricks because it took me a very long time to secure this bag it took me a very very long time and then i was like uh, -uh i don't have time to play these games i'm about to be on it so i was on it and I got my baby. I'm so excited, y'all. I love this bag so, so much. And I just, I had the bag and I was actually gonna do a, a reaction video to me unboxing it. But honestly, I could not wait. I waited like a week. And then after I graduated, I was just like, nah, I need to celebrate. And I need to take her with me to, oh! <laughs> I need to take her with me to celebrate. So that's what I did. And so yeah, now the video has turned into tips and tricks and what to secure your bag and what you can actually fit in your bag so yeah and i know i heard a couple of you know people saying that this is just like a regular old bag that you can get from h m the quality is bad no the quality is great this is not no bag you can just get from h m it's vegan leather but it's quality vegan leather so it's very durable you know still treat it as if you would treat any of your other designer bags um because i mean if you're wearing it a lot and you're not really taking care of it you're not putting it putting it in its dust or it's going to collect dust it's gonna it's going to start to look like the amount of wear you're putting on the bag so take care of your bag your vegan bag just as much as you would take care of any other bag if not more because it is vegan leather so keep that in mind um, but as far as quality it's great quality um everything looks good the bag is in mint condition and yeah i really have nothing negative to say about the bag the quality of the bag the shipping time any of that because it was very quick and you don't even have to pay shipping like it's free shipping which is a plus like you know shipping can you know can rack up your cost and to have free shipping you know that's a plus plus for me um and so i do have a little bonus for you guys for christmas i did get another toe far it was gifted to me and it was the one that i really really wanted so in addition to the mini the black mini i wanted a medium sized bag so that way i could use it for travel strictly for travel and let me show y'all what i got Okay, it comes in this brown box. And obviously the mini comes in a smaller brown box. So I'm gonna open it. And I already took a peek because I really can't help myself. I was so excited. But I haven't really, really got into it yet. So it came in this bag. And it came with this dust inside of this duster bag. Let me close it, hold on. So the mini also came in a duster bag. It was a mini duster bag. So all of the bags will come in a duster that looks like this. And then inside of the box came the packing list. So let's get into the color. If you didn't already see it as I was struggling with it. It is dun, 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 the green one. I'm so excited about this bag, you guys. You don't understand. This bag, this color, it's so beautiful, like money green. I just love it. So let me move this stuff out of my lap. So this is how big it is. I'm not going to stuff it with things, but I do hear that you can use it as a carry-on bag. Like a lot of people who have the medium-sized bags say that you can fit a decent amount of stuff in this bag and you can use it as your spin and night bag or your travel bag. You can definitely fit a great amount of stuff in here. 
a couple of outfits. A couple of my friends have their Telfar bags and they have the medium size. So they, they told me that you can fit a good amount of stuff in here. If you're trying to use it for travel, you know, like three to four outfits, you know, you can probably fit that in here, they say. Okay, so this is what the inside looks like. It's it's like a like a dark gray. And then it has a tag. And then it has a little zipper compartment. The mini um the mini bag does not have this little zipper compartment. And you can fit a couple of things in here as well if you're using it for travel like your toilet trees and so yes i really wanted to show you guys this i could not wait i have not used the bag yet um so yeah i just wanted to show you guys how it looked so beautiful and i the last bag that i want and i think i'm gonna be done is the um mini green one and I've been eyeing the mini yellow one as well. So I don't know, we'll see. But for now, I just want the mini green one. And I think I'll be good for a little while. But the prices are amazing. So that's why I don't feel as bad because they're not breaking your pockets to purchase, you know? They are pretty affordable. Darn, I forgot I'm recording on my phone. But I believe the mini was $150. And like I said, there is no shipping cost. So it was $150, the mini. And then this, the medium, I believe, is $202 or $250, I believe. It's either one of those. I'm almost certain. Um, but I'll leave a link to the website in the description box so you guys can access it there. But here's my medium and here's my mini. I don't know. I might wear it as a crossbody also. I can't stand up because I don't have bottoms on. <laughs> but this is, yeah, I'll wear it as a crossbody most likely, depending on how much that I have in my bag when I use it for travel. But yes, guys, that is all I wanted to share with you all. I hope this video is interesting and informative and I hope it helps you guys secure your Telfar bag because honestly, if you don't have a Telfar yet, what are you doing? What are you doing? Tell me. You have to have a Telfar. It has to be in your closet. It's a must. So, yes. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. And as always, please like, share, subscribe to my channel, and turn your post notifications on so you know when I post a video. If you guys have any video ideas for me, please leave that in the description or the comment section below because I want to start making more, as I mentioned in my previous video, I do want to start doing a little bit more life. Life, um, I cannot talk tonight. I really cannot. What am I trying to say? This happens in every one of my video. I always lose my train of thought or forget a word. Lifestyle. I want to start including more lifestyle videos for you guys. So please let me know in the description, the let me know in the comment section below what you guys would like to see. Um, and you guys can look forward to um, another little update video or maybe like a chit chat, get ready with me um, video like I mentioned about my um, update where I'm at with nursing, things like that. The next journey of my life post nursing school. So I hope you guys have a happy, happy new year. I hope you guys are staying safe and stay staying healthy, and I'll see you guys in my next upload. Mm -hmm.